Apfel Doctor Germany, my name is Ben. Hello and welcome to the micro soldering or today to the review show. Um, what I got for you today is something uh, which Union Repair uh, mailed me um, and it's a really nice thing. Um, a lot of you use JVC soldering stations like the CD2SE. I don't use it, I use a NACE to be. Um, and my or name to be and my name to be has two outputs for two different um, soda irons. Okay, um, is it called iron? Yeah. Here for yeah. two soda irons. Okay, so the CD2SE and a lot of these other um, uh, JBC stations only have one output, so we can only use one iron. So if you want to use the second one, you need to buy a second station. That's expensive. So now there is something new on the market and I want to show it to you this is the TEC extension module here we got it it looks great and with that module you can use two irons at one station at one CD2 SE that's really great all the station all the stations which uh, have the outputs for the two uh, T210 or the T245 you can use with uh, the TC extension module. You can get it at the Union Repair website, and it's uh, it's about 100 US dollar, I think. So it's really not much, and um, it's really uh, an amazing and a great tool. And I just want to show you on hands what we need to do for get it working. So you have the main unit here. And you can place your soldering station, I just plug it out here, you can place your soldering station right on top of this TEC extension module, okay? So it doesn't take any space on your, on your table, because you can just put the JBC station on it, okay? So after that, you see, I show to you on the back side, you see some ports, okay? You see A1, B1, B2. Uh, for another iron but we only have the A and uh, B1 here so it's just simple to install it this cable goes straight to the JBC station to the channel where you normally connect your solder iron okay then you get the power plug the power plug into the JBC station and then you take your solder iron one to A and you solder iron 2 to B1. Okay, so now we got at one station a T245 and a T210. So, and now we can just easily use that for soldering. So, you don't need to, if we, if you only have one station and you often use the 245 for things like iPad Pro power IC uh, taking out without uh, without hot air you will need that um, that bigger um, that bigger iron 245 and you always have to change it okay or you buy another station so now you can just plug both of these irons at one station and can use it easily so I just need a power plug I can get it here so at the power plug we plug in at the TC extension module. So now we can just switch on our JVC. And you see, okay, tool in the stand, no heat. I get the tool out and it heats up. So tool one works without any problem. Tool in the stand not to heat. Tool 2, power, works, plug it back again, okay, it says no tool in the stand, no heat, okay, works. Tool 1 out, it's really just great. So you can work with one station and two solder irons. Let's test another thing. I saw that on the back side is a port for another iron and I just want to check if it works um, with that NT105 out of my nase or my name. I just want to see 
if it works. So I click it out here, get it in here. I just want to see if that works or not. I don't know if it's made for that. And you see, yeah, you can use, and that's really amazing. You can use that NT105. Yeah, should work. Just give me a little bit of solder. Yeah, do you see that? You can, that's really great, Andy, or not? So you can use this NT105 iron with your CD2SE. Let's take a look if what happens if we place it back here. You will, or just have a look here when we plug it back. Okay, therefore, just have a look at Union Repair, write them an email. Therefore, you just need another stand. I think they will surely sell them when you got this port on the JBC here, on this TEC extension module for the JBC. Um, there must be a stand um, for that NT105 solder iron, but that's really amazing, Andy, or not? So you can use your main station um, with, your, uh, um, with your T210 and you can use uh, NT105 or NT115 out of a nase to B or out of a nase to C. And that's really an amazing thing. Um, so you don't need to buy um, the head station. And uh, when you think about that uh, nane or nase, um, costs about 1200, 1200 euro and um, a CD2SE costs about 300 euro or 350 you can save a lot of money because you just need to buy this head unit CD2SE about 300 or 350 euro and the NT105 about 70 euro so you are about 400 420 euro and you got an, a nano iron and can use the NT105 or NT115 with your CD2SE. So for me, this extension module is really, really a great thing and I can recommend it to everybody. It's, it costs nothing, 100, 110 euro, uh, dollar, dollar, 100 or 110 dollar on union repair. And um, you can use uh, every iron with that uh, for me. I would say buy that because it's a great tool and um, I hope you will like that. Spread the video so everybody sees you don't need to buy uh, the name anymore. You just can buy the, the iron alone and use it with your CD2SE. I hope um, it helps you a little bit uh, and I hope um, the video is okay for you. I'm out. Um, now I will enjoy the weekend. You will get no repair video today. I just wanted to present the product here. Um, yeah, if you want to learn things uh, like soldering, micro soldering uh, on smartphone PCBs, you can easily do that at the Bottle of Repair School Germany. Um, and if you are working at the repair industry for smartphones and tablets, you can join our Facebook group, Smartphone Repair Group Germany. I'm out. Buy that TSC, uh, TEC extension module from Union Repair. It's my tip for you. It's really amazing. I'm out. Have a nice weekend. Yours, Ben. Boom! Back to life again.